A year with the highest budget guys, highest budget. And this is how it looks like. No season opening video, bugs, $200 skin, a mythic skin with a worse value than legendary skin, a video for anniversary made by an AI, remove pinks, again bugs, even more remove pinks, problems with cheaters, shitty emporium, even more bugs, another $200 skin. Okay, you know what? I guess that's enough. You get it. I have no idea what's going on with Riot, but something is probably not right. They have been acting so strange lately that it's starting to feel as if League was being developed by a different company. Imagine hyping the entire player base by saying that this is the highest budget year and then do basically nothing. I mean, sure, Battle Arena was good, but there's no way this is where all the money went into. On the Rift, we've seen some radical changes against toxicity like never before. Some of them are nice, but others are just making the game worse and less fun. Before that, we also got some ranking adjustments. And again, some are nice, but others not so much. However, that's pretty much it. Nothing special happened in the lore, and nothing special happened in the game. Instead, we got some ridiculous $200 skins, which are basically only a little better looking chromas, and that's it. Why did they even bother telling us about the highest budget ever, if they failed to deliver even the fucking skins? And guess what? They want to make even more of these abominations. By the way, these are all the cinematics or music videos that we got this year. And now compare it with what we got in 2020. Crazy, right? So why all the hype? Look, I'm just worried that all of these are just bad signs. Signs of the end of League as we all know it. I started playing this game because of how Riot was back then. It felt like they actually cared about the game, but now I can't help but say that they are getting more greedy while we are getting less and less. Unfortunately, the $200 skins only support this statement of mine. And sadly, it's not only about skins and lesser content, they are becoming pretty ignorant and stubborn as well. Whoever mentioned cheaters on the main subreddit gets cancelled. Is your champion about to receive a change that will completely revamp its playstyle and nobody likes it? Well, too bad, nothing you can do no matter how much you spam Riot. Moreover, the bugs are getting worse with each year. I don't do coding, but I think it's very obvious that their code is slowly but surely breaking down. And if they don't do anything about it, I don't think they'll be able to further develop this game. Maybe that will be their breaking point, which will finally make them realize that ignoring the problems leads to nowhere. And maybe, just maybe, they will finally record the game. Look guys, there's no way this game will ever die. No matter how many videos there are about it on YouTube, no matter whoever says it, this game is unkillable at this point. In fact, it's so large that even if the wall riot disappeared at this very moment, the community would take over and make sure that the game lives on, even if the game would have to be recorded from the very first line of code. But that doesn't change the fact that the game can become a complete shit. So as long as Riot is in charge, it's completely up to them to avoid this fate. But as of now, we are heading a full course into the biggest shit on this planet.